Hello everybody, Gavin here, and today we are demoing the back gate of a two-door Cyber Orange Bronco. And so, so you know, how you open it, I think you might already know. You pull it, and then so there's one position here, then you pull it back, there's another, and then this is the full extension, like right there. Right there, that's the full extension where it stays. You can extend it farther, but you have to hold it. See, it stays there, but doesn't stay there. So, that's the back gate. And then, so here are two little holes for you. You can buy a um, aftermarket table, and you pull this, and you put the hooks into there. And then the bronc and sorry, I was about to say bronco, but the table hangs down right there. Then we have the um, what do you call this? What's that? Swing gate? Or a piston? Uh, it's like or, a, it's no, like a no. shock. Like a, it's a like a shock absorber. Like a, it, it controls the opening and closing. Yeah. So um, that's that. And then there's some kind of vent for something here. So that's the back gate. And then you know how it locks. So push it back, and there's no like stop for the pushing back. And then you just close it. It might sound like it not closed, but but it does close. So we got the um, 35 inch tire on the back. So the backup camera is right here. So if 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 you still have this tire on it, the tire won't block the view of the backup camera, which normally would be there. So that's definitely a smart idea to put it there. So that's that, and then, you know, Ford logo. So, and then we have, I guess, the brake light up there. Again, open. Close. And so that's gonna wrap it up for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you'll get notified when a new video comes out. And bye-bye.